guys, it's Kaylee. Welcome to the very first of my life after college vlogs. First of all, I want to apologize to anybody that has been a subscriber to me for a long time and is like, where the hell have you been? Because I will full on admit I haven't been on my channel in like two months. And that is like really bad for somebody that was posting two videos a week <laughs> formally. So anyway, I wanted to let you guys know that I am trying to be on YouTube, um, but the videos are just not going to be as current as they used to be. Um, my computer is also like a complete piece of junk right now, so until I get something better, that's just what's happening. So anyway, um, as you guys can see, uh, this is a house tour today. That is the vlog. We are having a snowstorm here in Maine, and I'm home and unable to do any Christmas shopping. So I was like, we're just going to make do, and we're going to make a video today. Um, Mr. Brandon is working, and so I have the entire house to myself, except for my cat that we just got last Sunday. Uh, you guys will see her in this video because she loves to follow me around unless she decided to go to sleep, which she has been awake literally all day, so Hopefully she didn't go to sleep right as I started filming, but we rescued her a Week ago, like I said, and her name is Evie like the Pokemon and she's adorable and cute and She's like a year old, so she still got that kitten fun stuff going on and yeah, so I just wanted to show you guys my new house. We moved in about a month ago. I said in my last video, uh, my update, my life update, that we were going to be moving into an apartment, but that actually fell through. And then Brandon's cousin was like, you can rent my house. So we were obviously like, yeah, we want to rent your house. So we did that and we moved in and we've been here, yeah, like I said, a month. And I figure it was about time to do a house tour. So I cleaned my entire house this morning. <sighs> so that's, that's where we're at, which was fun. So I'm going to be doing commentary live from behind the phone while I film. Because I'm filming on my phone, as you guys could probably tell. Um, and yeah, I just don't want to film a voiceover. It's way harder to do that and like talk really fast and try and get everything out at once. So yeah, I'm just going to talk live and just say things as they come to me. And I will give you a tour of my entire life. Yeah, except the outside because we're not going out in the snow. So you guys can forget about that right now. But I'll show you. the. You guys want to see it? Like, you want to see... Yep. Yep. You probably can't even, like, actually see the snow, but it's everywhere. Okay, so without further ado, the house tour. Let's go. Okay, so I'm going to be completely honest and tell you guys that my phone doesn't apparently have storage or keeps filming after, like, a minute. So hopefully that doesn't keep happening. But... Here we go, this is the living room. So um, behind me is the front door. And like I said, we're not going out there because it's Antarctica. Um, oh, you can see the snow now. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Anyway, so this is the front door. This is where we keep our shoes. Uh, when we come in, it normally looks like a giant pile of shoes, but I cleaned it up. Um, we have this stuff on the wall. I'm gonna go, as I go through, I'll tell you guys where we bought things too because I know a lot of house tours do that so I want to be fancy and keep up with the trends. Um, so that's our mail thing that we got. Um, I got that at Kohl's and the cloth is from Target. Um, if you ever want to get home decor, just straight up go to Target because they have everything you'll ever need and want. Um, so right here's the couch. Throw is from Martin's. If you're not from Maine, you won't know what that is. Um, the couch itself was Brandon's cousin's and he left that for us and it worked out because it's gray and we actually repainted all the walls um, gray tones because the whole house was tan before and we didn't really like it. Pillows are from Walmart um, and honestly, these are the best. Obviously, you can't touch them like I can, but they are the most plush things I've ever 
experience. They're so great. <laughs> um, we got the coffee table from Walmart. I don't know where that basket came from. I got that back in college. I have zero idea, but God, it is out of place. There we go. And then we have the recliner, which was also Brandon's cousin's. And so those are the two like pieces of furniture that we got from him. Super helpful. Um, over in this corner, we have a basket that has a bunch of blankets in it because the house is wicked warm, but we do have drafts and we just love blankets. So we have a whole basket of them. And then this is the first nightstand. That lamp came from Target. Um, and we have our stockings. So this one's Evie's that I just got yesterday actually from Target too. And I did some puffy paint on it to write her name. And then this one's mine, but I don't know where Brandon's is, but when we get them all together, they're gonna go on this wall. Which brings me to Christmas, so tree. So we have our tree. Oh, but actually, no. My mom got me that in New York City. So this is our tree, which I have to back up so much right now. But um, it's real. We got it from a tree farm in Maine. Um, we, yeah, like I basically decorated the whole thing. Let's just get real. <laughs> um, star came from Walmart. Most of like the shatterproof ornaments that I'm showing you right now came from Walmart. And then we have like our personal ornaments um, like I have a bunch of Sesame Street Hallmark ornaments from like the 90s, so there's that. So that's the tree, tree skirt my mom gave us, and then we have a nativity set, which Brandon's family member, I think his great aunt, um, actually made this, and it's so adorably beautiful and cute, and we don't actually have the actual manger to put over it right now, so yeah. Um... This is the other end table. Normally the chair would be where the tree is, but um, the matching lamp. We got the end tables from Walmart too. They match the coffee table. And then I have this cute little thing on the door and I have a wreath on the door too, but I'm not opening it right now because it is really cold outside. This is Brandon's movie collection. Yep, there's a lot of them there. So we have that and then obviously the TV and the TV stand which we also got from Walmart. I got that in college. Um, this village is a combo of my grandmother's village and Brandon's and this all lights up but I didn't light it up for this. I should have. And then over here we have Evie's water bowl and her dishes which we just got at PetSmart. They're wicked cute. And we also got her this scratching thing because she was digging our bed, which was a problem. She was digging like the, I'll show you our headboard and stuff, but it was, yeah. But she likes this and we got her some toys too. We honestly spent the most on the cat last night. <laughs> um, so then if we turn, we're in the kitchen. It's a big open concept room. We have this high top, which yeah, you guys can giggle. These chairs are way too short for the table. They did not come with it. We got them separate and we actually need to cut the table down because it just doesn't work. <laughs> but yeah, so that's the table. And then if you come this way, that's the front door again. Um, most of the stuff in the kitchen, appliance wise and cooking wise, came with the house. Um, Brandon's cousin actually gave us a lot of his stuff. So, yeah, we have really nice stainless steel appliances. I meant to light this candle for the video. God, I suck at aesthetic. Um, yep, yeah, so we have all matching appliances. Our microwave doesn't have a handle. We'll just keep moving on here. Um, Brandon's family member made this angel. I thought I would point that out. It's beautiful. Um, yeah, so everything you see on the counters was not, they, it was already with the house. Um, dishwasher, which is so nice. I love having a dishwasher. Um, in college we had one too, but I mean, this one's really, really nice. Um, and we also have a garbage disposal, which is the best. So this is the backyard, which we really don't have one, but I'll show you anyway. It looks so much nicer with snow on it, actually. It's a big rock, basically. Um, and then we have Keurig, which wasn't ours. That was with the house too. And then the fridge, which I'll back up, is just a double door. 
fridge. So this closet is our utility closet because the house sits on a rock, like I said, and so we don't have a basement. Where's the light for in here? Sorry. So this is where we keep our trash, and then we have a mini fridge that has, um, we keep our alcohol in there. And then just, it's basically, <laughs> Nerf guns. It's basically just storage. We have like our brooms and cleaning stuff in here. And then that's our propane box, and then the electrical box is in here too. So it's all right, right in the house. Let me shut this off. So that's that closet. And then next door is the quote pantry, which we haven't really found. We oh sorry, we haven't really needed um, this as a pantry. But what we do keep in here is cleaning supplies, and then EV stuff is here, and then alcohol. <laughs> Typical 20-year-old lives, alcohol and cats, and Clorox wipes. <laughs> so that's that. Okay, so moving on. So now I'm going to bring you down the hallway. So... The first door is the office, and this is the one, this is where I was filming before. Um, it's not done yet. We're planning on putting a ton of stuff on these walls, which are actually damaged. We have to fix them. But, so we have the desk where my computer currently is. We're going to have a desktop eventually. It's really echoey in here, sorry. This is my desk where I have all my makeup. It's like kind of going to be a vanity when I have a mirror. Um... I keep all my, like, that's my hair stuff, makeup, everything is here. Um, and then this is the front yard again. You can see our animal, I mean, our uh, lights and stuff. We have a deer and a tree and more stuff, but you can't see it all. And then if I pan this way, we have my bookshelf is in the corner and then the full-length mirror. And then we have Evie's litter box in here. And then this box has a bunch of stuff that's going to go on the wall, but we haven't gotten to that yet. So anyway, so out of here, if you go across the hallway, it's the bathroom. So, I mean, again, all of this came with the house. Um, washer and dryer came with the house, which was so nice. They are gorgeous. I'll turn the light on. They're really, really nice. Um, that's exactly what I wanted. Oh, clearly I need to th take things out of the dryer. Um, and then... Um, if you pan all the way around, the tub is here. And I got this um, shower curtain at Walmart and the mat at Walmart and then um, the toothbrush holder at Walmart. So they have that whole set there. And this room, we didn't paint the walls. We kept them the same. Um, you can actually see where I went to test a new color and we didn't end up doing that. <laughs> Um, but yeah, so this is the bathroom. Oh, and up here, I forgot to show you. So I got that adorable sign at Big Lots. And it's actually been really useful because we always have socks that don't have a match. Um, and then up here is just our laundry stuff and toilet paper. Um, Brandon actually wanted to put doors in front of the washer and dryer, but because the toilet is so close to it, we ended up not doing that. So that's okay. But yeah. Okay, moving on. So now, here is the guest room. This is, you'll recognize my bedding from college. I got it at Bed Bath & Beyond and it was fairly expensive and so I didn't want to stop using it just randomly. So we put it on the guest bed. Um, Evie spends a lot of time in here, so her she has toys under the bed. Um, and then I have like my giraffe collection here. And also stuff from when I was little on the bed. So when um, our niece comes over, she always comes in here and plays and rips everything apart. <laughs> and then this is actually where Brandon's closet is. So he has the guest room closet. And I use the master bedroom closet. We don't have lamps yet, um, which is fine because we haven't really had anybody over to stay, but... Um, the nightstands were Brandon's. He got them at Walmart. Really, really cheap. Um, yeah. So that's the guest room. And we're actually going to try and find the cat right now because I'm betting you she's under the bed. So let's look. Yep. And she is. Come here. Come here. 
she's gonna be a butthole and not come out because of course when I want her to come out she's not going to want to hi Evie you can kind of see her ears over there on the left <laughs> what are we doing She's sleeping. I won't bug her. I will um, maybe insert some pictures and video of her during this so that you guys can see what she looks like. Okay, now the master. So this is the master bedroom. This is the room that I think that Brandon and I both really like the most. Um, we got our comforter at Macy's. It is a pure down comforter. Lamps Brandon already had. Um, nightstands are from Walmart. They're literally $9 a piece and they work out perfectly. So, um, the headboard we actually made ourselves, which was really hard, but you can look up the tutorial online. Um, it's right on Pinterest. You'll see it looks just like this headboard. Um, or you could go on like Wayfair. They sell them for about the same price that it took for us to build this one. So yeah. <laughs> Um, we don't have a bureau yet, so I have my drawers from college. This is all my clothes. And then that painting is not hung up yet. Um, and then in the corner, we just have our laundry. We have clothes and towels separated, so. Um, and the laundry basket is from TJ Maxx, and I have that all through college. And it's still going strong, so that's good. Um, yeah, so this is, and then this is Brandon's side of the bed. Um, Yeah. And then over there is my closet, which I'm not going to show you because it's a mess. <laughs> but that's where I keep all my clothes. And it's a pretty good sized closet. So, yeah. Suitcase, that's from Kohl's. It's Chaps. And my work bag is from Target. Um, yeah. So, we really, really, really love the house. Um, that is pretty much all of it. It's not very big, but it's just the right size for two people and their cat. So anyway, I'm going to cut back to me and we will finish up the tour. So thank you guys so much for watching. I'm really glad that I was able to do the tour today. To give you a little backstory on our neighborhood, we live in a really quiet area. It's like separated from the rest of the town. It's in a development and there's only like one way in, one way out of the development. So there's not a lot of traffic at all. And I'm actually very excited for the summertime because there's going to be tons of places to go for like walks at night and if you have a dog it's like the perfect area which obviously we're not gonna go walk our cat but um yeah it'll be good <laughs> to just get outside in this area so thank you guys so much for watching I didn't want to make this too too long it's probably already going to be pretty long but thank you guys so much and um again I'm going to try and vlog more vlogging is easier for me because I can get away with using my phone and not having to come up with content twice a week. So uh, vlogging is good. And I'm going to try and do that more. And I'm hopefully going to do a vlog about Evie coming up. Because I know how people love pets. So I will try and feature her in a, in a vlog very soon. And yeah. So thank you guys. And subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I don't put out videos very often. But when I do... I strive for quality. <laughs> kind of. <laughs> Thank you guys. Bye.